We are not reporters nor journalists. The views, information, or opinions expressed are strictly and solely barber shop talk. We pride ourselves on being uncut, unapologetic, uncompromising, unfiltered, and refuse to conform to anything less than. So if you can't, cut the cap. This ain't the show for you. Yo, actually, yo, bro, let's talk about it. Trump, man. What we about can't avoid it, bro. You know what I mean? We, we know, I know we're not politicians or nothing, but my man got 34 felon counts, all right? He just got, you know, 34 felon counts is number eight, too. Um, you, what's your thoughts on Trump uh, with 34 felon? Is he going to jail? Is he yo, getting locked up? He's the only motherfucker I know that can't go to jail. I don't give a fuck what you do to him. He just can't go to jail. <laughs> that shit just don't make... 34? Bro, there's somebody in the hood right now that's fighting one and talking about life. This motherfucker has 34. 34 counts, bro. You know what I mean? Um, you see what he said? He says, I'm okay with it. I saw one of my lawyers the other day on television saying, oh, no, you don't want to do that to the president. I said, you don't beg for anything. But Trump added, I don't think the public would stand it. I'm not sure the public would stand for it. I think he's starting to get delusional. <laughs> Why do you say that? Yeah, hear me? yeah we hear you. Yeah, okay. yeah absolutely. Because yeah, yeah. he said, because there was another thing he came out, he was like, he'd be good in jail. Like, he don't want no help. So, like, he, he'd just be saying some off-the-wall stuff at this point. But Could it be Trump is trying to get the uh, the black vote by saying that? Like, the hood vote? Like... Yo, now look, I've been to jail. I didn't do all this, bro. I'm one of I'm one of y'all. Like I could. Yo, he I, came to the wait. Bronx just a little while ago, bro. For like, why was you here? Ooh, okay. Everybody in the Bronx, every politician in the Bronx, is like, yo, we don't want you here. What are you doing here? Did he come for the? You know what I mean? To get those votes, the hood. You know what I mean? The yeah, way that's what it was. Wing, that's what it was. Won't dare step. Yeah, that's what it was. Wow. Yan said no one is greater than the law. So thirty four counts. You see him going to jail for a long time or beating us? Nah, he, he, he I, they're felons. So a felony would carry at least a minimum a year, and he got 34 counts of them. So by technical terms, of course, he's not going to get there. He probably should get at least 34 years. But I, I don't know if you go do that. But the crazy part is he can go to jail and still be president. Hold on, what? There's nothing. He could go to jail right now and still be president. And still be president. There's nothing. And then, um, because he, if he, if he gets elected president, then there's some special circumstance where they gotta let him out or some crazy. But yeah, he can actually run for president and win being in jail. Is this true? Yep. So it's it's all types of shit, crazy shit. Yo, that is insane. I didn't know that, bro. Thirty-four nothing- years. Man, he's yeah, been so. d- damn damn calm man his whole life. They not gonna yeah. lock him up. Right here. Why do so I feel says, like they not gonna lock him up too? Y'all think I don't know, man. They're not locking yeah, up. Yeah. Yeah. So it's, the constitution said doesn't hold on, let me finish. The constitution doesn't stop candidates from running for president while serving jail time. Two previous what? candidates, um, Eugene and Debs in nineteen twenty and Light. Leiden and LaRouche in 1992 both ran from prison. If Trump is sentenced to prison, it's still possible he could run for president from behind bars. Yo, so they could be like free my, uh, they could be like free my president, like free Trump shirts? He'll have, he'll, it'll probably kind of be the same. You know, they'd be locking him up in the White House. They'll be letting him win. (laughs) 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 He already going to have protection. He probably going to, you know, be a soul. I don't know. That's so crazy. You know what it is? It's going to be the biggest embarrassment for the, one of the presidents in the United States to go to jail. It's going to look bad on the United States. That's he, why that's they don't the reason want he's him not. to be in jail. It's going to look bad. Mm. It's going to okay. make the United States look weak. Okay. Mm. So they got to figure this shit out. Like, this motherfucker stole files, top secret files that he was not giving back. He should have been wow. in jail for treason, if anything. Yo, so hold on. Like, was he paying off women too, or was that a rumor? Any y'all know him. about that? Look at him. He was doing everything, bro. I mean, his wife didn't want to touch him, so I, don't, I wouldn't. I wouldn't be put a pass. Melina definitely was just tired of him. <laughs> this is crazy. Yo, why does he look like that? Like he got the rock eyebrow. Like, like a lot going on in his pick. Yo, he gave black people chicken nuggets. Ain't no way he got chicken nuggets. 
I love chicken nuggets. We gave we gave them when he, he knew when that. He, when That's I, when why he, he gave it. <laughs> crazy, bro. So he got forty counts in total. <laughs> <laughs> That's <laughs> just, I love chicken. <laughs> yeah, I'm a huge supporter of chicken nuggets. Man. Oh god. So crazy. so this was a, he had forty. He got charged with forty counts in all. Thirty-two counts of unlawful retention of national defense information. One count of conspiracy to obstruct justice. One count to withhold um, document or a record. One count to corruptly conceal a document or a record. One count of concealing a document in a federal investigation. One count of scheme to conceal. One Man. count of false. Listen, it, it it got three more. I'm not reading them. So it sounded like he tried to hide something, and they hit him with every. You know how they, they hit you with the book where they, yeah, they did one the, thing and they hit you with the works. He got the same. Those are the same uh, accounts that my man got. <laughs> that's, Yo, crazy. that's crazy. He linked up. Uh, Yo, you linked. know what's the funniest yeah. shit, though? Out of this whole shit? A lot of the people that fuck with Trump, they be like, Trump gave away all that money, right? He gave yeah. everybody all that fucking money. All them, what you call them shits? What, the PPP? So, PPP loans? PPPs and all that shit when he was giving out all that free money to people. And everybody be like, yo, I fuck with Trump because he was giving us all that money. Bro. Man, I never got none of that peep. I wish I had to do how to get some of that peep. Nah, I don't know, motherfuckers. Niggas yeah, getting nah, nothing right that. now for yeah. that shit. Yeah. Oh, no, I could have covered it. back. I could have covered it. People start wilding with them PPA. I took five grand. Okay. Yeah, yeah nah, yeah, it ain't coming, you, coming for you for yeah, that. Five grand. They, I didn't and know you can, money. And if they caught you, if you could, if you could pay it back, then it's, it'd just be oh, like a lean or something. That fine, but man, people, was doing people were doing 100K, home. 200K. <laughs> they can't pay that back. They working at McDonald's. They also yeah. dumb and dumb. Remember when they had a they suitcase full of IOUs? Like, ain't no way. That's tough. But you know why Ooh. people start getting caught? Because all that money that they was taking out, they was giving to the people within the thought process of the people will spend the money back into the economy. Mm-hmm. Like for the GDP, you know, like that's our report card saying that our economy is healthy. Right. But the money is only counted for when we actually spend it back. Ah. So when you did that during COVID, people couldn't go nowhere. Everything was shut down. We couldn't spend that money. So all that money went into people's savings. Okay. And it was like, okay, so we really fucked ourselves because mm, now the people making money off the money. Yeah, like we can't even, we're not even getting that money back. So now you turn around, you do the same thing with these fucking immigrants. You bring the immigrants here, you give them a fifteen hundred dollar card. But now you smart because you say, well, now they can only spend this card inside the deli. So we're gonna give you the fifteen hundred, but you only spend it in the deli. Exactly. Now we could get that money back <clears> to <throat> the GDP, and we could track yeah. all that, and we could boost the economy up. Like ah, okay. people don't understand, you going for Trump, and you think he's doing nobody. They, they not thinking about us. They don't give a fuck about you. They thinking about the economy and how to make more money and make the shit look good. They don't give a fuck about us. Okay. Look at that nigga. Do he look like he? I ain't gonna lie. I'll invite him to the cookout though. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> Trump I mean, like he know where the hoes at. I just wanted to ask y'all that. I know we're not really, you know, heavy into politics and all that, but thirty-four counts is crazy, man. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, man. That's that's pretty. Any last thoughts on this, man? We are gonna keep it moving, man. You know what I mean? Get, Listen, get, um, get biting the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> no, guy, other than that, yeah. Listen, I, I don't, I was, a, I don't, I'm gonna just say this. I don't care. I don't agree with a lot of shit that Trump represents. Okay, I did a lot. I did like the tax breaks, though. Once you make a certain amount of money when he was in office, compared to what the hell is going on now, uh-huh. and that's all I'm gonna say because you know I, I wasn't getting taxed as much, and my tax returns was hitting when he was in office. So <laughs> I believe it's that. Okay, okay. I mean, you know, I feel like you know what I mean. 